While high schools all over the country are cutting budgets, and the first thing to go is usually the music department, McKinley yeah. High here in St. Louis, McKinley Classical McKinley. Leadership Academy. Is that is that actually... That's, the, yeah, okay. that's, our, that's our true title. They're is, dropping CDs from uh, Shock City down on Gravoy, and uh, Bob Dory is our director is with us today. It's so professional. It's so, like you have <laughs> these beautiful posters, and you have a CD. What high school band has a CD? Uh, we actually <laughs> didn't find anybody else. Um, no kidding. Anywhere in the crowd. United States. What we did find out, there was one done at Southwest High School 40 years ago by oh, the gentleman oh who hired me for the district. His gentleman was Bob Nordman, who retired in 2005. And he was a great help to me with this. But in those days, oh, they cut great. an album. Well, how, how, what is your secret, Bob? How did yeah. this happen? How, how, w- people are cutting budgets, and uh, you have no athletic department there, so the only thing left to cut <laughs> and <laughs> it I, really and is music. I just music. wanted to see what kind of music they have on well, here. Well, um, we have a, a very thriving band boosters group, and the parents pay uh, for all See, that's all always the key, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, the district has, yeah. has, has not kicked in. Uh, anything towards this? Sure, sure. That's and and we have asked them, and and yeah. and and they've been very polite. <laughs> they've been very polite, but they've yeah. been very firm. Here, here's some money for football. You know, <laughs> well, actually, we don't have football. We, and you're right. We don't. We're 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 kind of the egghead school, as I call it. Oh, which that's is right. Very cool. Yeah, yeah so, you are actually so. a, a gifted, really good one. Um, it is a gift, yeah. Yeah. middle and high. And so. and this the. Uh, uh, songs here. You have the theme from Hawaii Five O and mm-hmm. Crimea River and all. We this, heard you jumping know. at the Woodside Count Basie as we came into this interview. Nice. Yeah. Are you the uh, the mastermind on the selections? Yeah, pretty well. <laughs> although I take a lot. We're of, gonna find out from you guys yeah. if this is true. So. Yeah, we have. We I have actually some of the get a lot members. of suggestions from the uh, the Basie stuff uh, came about because we've been. Uh, competing at the Basie Festival in Kansas City the last three years. So you go to a Basie oh. Festival, you learn Basie. Yeah. And uh, the last three years, we've gotten uh, um, awards for for outstanding ensembles. Now, now i got to ask there. the question that's on my mind. I know it's on everybody's mind. <laughs> when you see a CD from a you know school band, <laughs> you think... Who's the audience for this other than the parents, parents and the family? Relatives, <laughs> friends. Is this music that is, you know, just great music that you want to play in your car or uh, well, You know what, Joy? It's good you asked that because they they do have a, a, a release party this Sunday, right? This Sunday. At the at Sheldon. The Sheldon. Uh, and and we need to introduce Abby and Phil yeah, and Ruth yeah. over and Ruth. here. Yeah. yeah, please. Hey uh, you guys, did you buy one of these? <laughs> well, they oh, get them. Knock they door get to door em. selling them. They get them. <laughs> so, so is life at, at McKinley for you guys like Glee? Is it kind of like that? Did you grow up on that? Yeah, but with a little less singing. <laughs> with less yeah. singing, that's We're right. We're instrumentalists. We yeah, don't sing well. The only difference, um, though, right? You know, their director sure can't sing, and they 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 realize that early on. What do you all play? That's what instrument Come over do you here play? and say what yeah, you play say, real quick. Say there. your name Get and who you, what do you do? What yeah. you play? Uh, my name's Abby and I play piano. Yeah. Okay. Oh, how about that? <laughs> I'm Ruth and I play bass. Okay. I'm Philip and I play bass trombone. Uh, Ruth, were you playing bass on that opening that we played with uh, the Count Basie tune? Mm-hmm. J- jumping yes, at the. It was. Wow. That was great. Yeah, nice work, That was work, really you good. Guys. Yeah. I'm really impressed. And she's only in seventh grade. How huh? about that? Wow. Yeah. Well, huh. congratulations to all of you. Yeah, it's just it's... we're proud of you. We, you're not even our kids, and we're proud of you. <laughs> <laughs> well, we're proud of McKinley. Yes. Uh, both of our kids uh, went from McKinley on to Metro, and when I mentioned that to Bobby, goes, oh, that's too bad. <laughs> Should have stayed at McKinley. I mean, but the teachers at McKinley are like that. They all just love their jobs. They love the people there. And it was a great experience for both of our children. And I'm glad. There. It's a good school. I've been there 14 years. I wouldn't teach anywhere else. Not and, many and people have stayed in high school for 14 years, Bob. That's true. That's <laughs> so. true. And, 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 and if I stay one more year, it'll, it'll actually hit my, my, my real high school experience, 15 years of hard time at Riverview Gardens, so, <laughs> where I graduated. So. Now, the, uh, can anyone go to the release party? Absolutely. This? All right. Absolutely. Let's get some details on that. It is uh, this um, Sunday. Am I looking at the right thing? Okay. Th- well, you have $10 general admission and mm-hmm. $25 VIP. What do you get for VIP? I assume you get one of these. You get a disc mm-hmm. and you get front row seating uh, or basically uh, as close to the stage as we can put you. Okay. And then the $10 will be farther back. Okay. And then we're also going to sell the discs individually for $20. So basically, so that's if you, a deal. So yeah, if you got a, an, a general admission and yeah. you want a disc, you're going to spend 30 bucks. Exactly. Just spend 25 and you get the whole package. How, how long is the program? Uh, we will fill the whole two hours. Um, the jazz band is the big band. That's 21 pieces. Mm-hmm. 
And then uh, we also cut three tracks on their bonus tracks for our combo. Our combo is basically a cut-down version. There's 11 mm. people in that. And I call it a jazz rock combo because it's not all jazz. Yeah, that's good um, to know because, I mean, even the jazz jazz alone. Well, you, know, you think they, of a, mar- they, they a band, the, you think of a marching band. You know, you're yeah. Thinking yeah. Do we don't do marching band. Uh, they yeah. do the old Tonight Show theme, Johnny yeah. Carson Tonight Show oh, theme. Oh, how great. Yeah, that's uh, what we opened with. The Memphis Blues, Witchcraft. Oh, I mean, so there's, yeah, a, there's good. a good combination of stuff here. There's a little bit of Herb Alpert in here do also. Do the students ever come to you and say, hey, let's do this? Oh, absolutely. That's nice. some of my best ideas I steal from them. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I don't pretend to know it all. Uh, <laughs> you just take you know, credit. <laughs> um, the, only, you know, the only thing that I'm real proud of is that there's really nothing real modern on here. Yeah. Um, because well, wait a minute. I, you know, you did Hotel California. That's yeah, well, somewhat, that's still in the yeah. '70s. But yeah. really, the, the the most modern song um, I have, Claire Stolze, who's not with us, is our main vocalist, and she actually talked me into doing this Amy Winehouse track. Oh, yeah, I noticed that. Sunday, and that's yeah. the one that really, you know, is is the oddball. It t- turned yeah. out beautifully, but she did. She had to talk me in. Well, you know, that, jazz so. is a uh, something that you can do a lot of. Just go off and do some riffs and stuff. Does any, are you ever able to do something original or come up with anything original? We haven't yet. I think that's down the road. Yeah. Um, I'll be very honest with you. I don't have time to write it. Yeah. That's what it comes down to. <laughs> yeah. I have three full bands and then department uh, chair duties. Yeah. And, you know, it, 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 there's simply, I'm barely, I'm, I'm barely able to meet myself coming and going now. How many pieces um, will be on stage on Sunday? 21 piece jazz Whoa, band. Whoa, that's Big wonderful. Band. That's, and, that's and great. And Sue Wise, by the way, we have to thank her. She is the one who came up with this idea. She says, would you like the Sheldon? Wow. And I'm like, you're what? offering me the Sheldon? Exactly. The most <laughs> and she says, yeah. She says, as long as you do it on a Sunday. Uh, do you the have nicest tickets acoustics. Here? Yes, these are tickets. Um, are, and, uh, and you don't have to do, we do paper, but then we're also on... Um, what is it? Brown, brown, brown bag. paper. Brown bag. Yeah, brown, ticket, brown uh, yeah, something. something. Yeah, the brown, one online. Just and like I can't that. remember it. <laughs> what you said. The, the, the word yeah. bag brown, is brown, yeah, brown, yeah, brown, brown paper ticket. Yeah. <laughs> yeah right. You know, again, I, 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 I'm old fashioned. I like. Yeah. The old, right. right. The old well, congratulations. Yeah, to all of you. congratulations. We'll see you we really Sunday. are proud of you. And thank you to Clayton's Bakery for making our segment possible through their generosity. Clayton's Bakery and Pastries in De Pair offering fresh baked goods right from St. Louis's earliest recipes in history. And fresh baked bread right from the break bakery, which I can't say five times in a row. 11,744 Manchester Road in De Pair.